Uh, mm. Chuck, I know you've got a good plan for the senator. And uh, is he hanging out with you this morning or is he uh, trying to get some uh, some sleep? Yeah, well, he's being sequestered in another room. It seems like when I uh, do these things, usually in this four o'clock <laughs> hour, Julian, Ben, he'll bring a toy to me and try to interrupt me while I'm, uh, <laughs> while I'm on the air with you. Julian, it's good to have you back. Thank we you. We missed you. I thank you. I and appreciate this is not it. Not really back, but kind of. <laughs> it was great. It was great to have those beautiful days off. So thanks, Chuck. Well, we're glad to say that the storms that rattled through here are over. Uh, some of you in Park County really had a tough time about three hours ago, two and a half, three hours ago. But let's show you live Doppler 13 radar right now. And the severe thunderstorm warnings are over. In fact, we're off to a really nice start from here on out. Now, Dayton, Columbus, Ohio, that's a different story. This is how it looked as these storms move through here with a lot of uh, strong gusty winds earlier on this morning. But right now, it is really warm. In fact, at 66, our current temperature, that's much warmer than the average high. And our dew point is high, too. So it does feel a little sticky out there. And the winds sustained at 16, but gusting in excess of that. It's going to warm up quickly during the day today, a really nice day overall until we get to late afternoon, early evening. And that's when we enter this slight risk for severe weather today. Now, currently, really warm out there. Again, as I mentioned, um, you know, Muncie's at 69, Bloomington and Bedford and Shelbyville all at 68 degrees this morning. And by the afternoon, we're up into the upper 70s, right around 77. Could it be cooler than that? Yes. It depends when this cloud deck arrives. Right now, we're going to go with 77, though. Uh, earlier this morning, I didn't think we'd get that warm, but I certainly do now. And then the showers and thunderstorms start to roll in here. So let's walk you through this. By the way, those bands that you see, the green is a marginal risk for severe weather. Uh, Indy under a slight risk of severe weather. And then Bloomington, Columbus on the south on a scale of one to five, you would be under a three. So a more enhanced risk of severe weather tonight. Well, here's how this all plays out. So this is seven o'clock tonight. Lafayette, Marion gets showers and thunderstorms. And then this really rolls through. Sean Ash, Angela Buckman will be with you covering this, and who knows, I may be too. This is 8 o'clock tonight as this uh, secondary line starts to move through, and I think that by 10 o'clock, a lot of this is through the metro, but Seymour could have some really strong thunderstorms at this time. Now, there will be some showers in back of this around midnight, but I think that all of this is over by Thursday, and then, boy, oh boy, do we take a drop in temperatures, a significant drop in temperatures, as a matter of fact. Uh, let me show you what that looks like here as the uh, seven-day outlook goes like this. Warm with some thunderstorms late this afternoon, 77. And how about this drop? Only 50 tomorrow, only 50 on Friday, and in the 50s with a chance for rain by Easter Sunday.